In this video, I'm gonna show you the single most important thing you need inside your content workflow to make it as efficient as possible. I work with a lot of large personal brands and content agencies who are producing and distributing a lot of content every single day. And before they started working with me, the number one thing that we were able to address right away is just how they organize their content and how do we automate that process so that they are set up for success as they push content through the entire workflow. So this is an automated system that I built out in Airtable, it's called the Content Engine. And this is a product that I sell to my clients that helps them organize and efficiently produce and distribute a lot of content at scale. So on the left here, you can see all of the different types of projects that we might have, YouTube videos, podcast videos, we might be batching a bunch of vertical videos, or we might be recording a single video for an ad, or we might have written content as well. What you can see here, number one, is that we are able to generate new ideas and run them through a Kanban style board, which allows us to track the status of every single project that we have in the system. But what you can also see is that once we actually start to script out a new video, in this case, it's for YouTube, the system automatically creates a lot of the things that we need for this particular video. You'll see that it's able to generate a script that we can use to fill out and script out the video. And you can see here that for each different type of content, we can attach a different script to that type of content. So when that content is generated, we can automatically copy that script template so that we can get to work and script out our videos. You can see here as well, it's automatically linking up the important SOPs and checklists we need in order to record this content. And best of all, you can see that it's already creating the folder structure for us to actually put all of this content in here. So as soon as we fire off that automation, which happens after we've actually picked the recording dates and publishing dates, it's creating the entire folder structure where we can drop in all of the final assets and our original raw recordings. And then we also have easy access to our script and the thumbnails and the video and also the copy for that content. And when you automatically create these folders, then it's something that you don't have to do manually. And you're also gonna be able to do it consistently without errors. So a lot of the clients that I work with often have SOPs that they've already created to manage all of their content, but they still need to go through and execute all of those activities one by one manually by person. And there's often chances for the person to make a mistake or they just skip that process altogether. So when you have automation, automatically create those folders and then link it for you, it makes that process less prone to error. It takes up a lot less time. And you also have easy access to get here, which increases the efficiency for your team because nobody is searching around for, hey, where did I put this video or this file? It's all located in Google Drive and linked directly here. We also create frame.io folders so that we can have a place to do team collaboration. This folder is automatically created. And as videos are created for this particular project, they can be dropped in there and then people can easily collaborate and provide feedback and give that feedback to the editors and then change the status so they can do that work. Now, there are a lot of other cool things that you can do as a result of keeping things organized and keeping everything stored in a database and keeping links to Google Drive folders and files in Google Drive. Like you can integrate with third-party APIs and use ChatGPT. And so those are a lot of extra benefits that you can take advantage of when you are storing your content, organizing it like this in an Airtable database, just like this. But still the most important benefit of automating all of these organizational tasks right up front and making sure that you have access to your scripts, your Google drive and everybody knows where everything is, is that right from the beginning, when you start a new project, a new video project, a podcast or a YouTube video, you are set up for success and you're making it easy on your team as well. As a leader of a content program, you have to make this process a fun and enjoyable process for your team. So by removing all of the rocks from their shoes, it's going to make it a more enjoyable experience. They'll do the tasks that they need to do and they can spend more time doing the creative type work that's going to make the content perform versus all of the tasks that they need to do in order to build a scalable content marketing program. So there you go. I hope you found this video valuable. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel if you found this interesting. It helps me out a lot and it tells me what you want more of. And if you'd like to create your own Airtable system just like this, make sure to check out the video above. I go in depth on how you can create your own Airtable database and connect up the different automations with Zapier to streamline your entire content workflow. I'll see you there.